Okay, this is a sandbar shark that we just caught here off the coast of Maryland. And as you can see, it's got some pretty significant wounds here from a gill net. This is a commercial gill net that this shark at some point became entangled in. And it's been entangled long enough that it, the shark has actually grown around the net. Okay, this is a monofilament gill net, a commercial net used for other fisheries. But this shark at some point got entangled in it. And here's the end result. This probably would eventually lead to mortality of this shark. It would probably die. Maybe fortunately, we caught him, and we're going to be able to remove the net here from it before we release the animal. And he should, hopefully, be able to recover from it. But as you can see, the problem with these monofilament nets is they don't rot away. And it's almost, imagine if you would, a tight rubber band around your neck um, for a long time. It's constantly going to be getting tighter and tighter and cutting into you. And again, you can see this is pretty significant. It, it cut down into the, the back of the shark this much and under the belly here. Okay, it's, it's also come through. So we're going to, we got the net free. Now we'll be able to turn the shark loose and he probably will be able to recover from these wounds. Hopefully we'll put a tag in them and maybe someday we'll get a, a return from them.